Hey everybody, how's it going? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, Thursday, April 18, 2019. The NFL schedules are out. NFL is king. Going to tell you a little bit about that and what we got coming up in just a minute. First, a quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com and just want to give it a trial run, it's a real cool way to do so. Click on the link below the video, get a free $60 account. Use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages over at DocSports.com. Again, $60 free account. And it all starts by clicking on the link below the video. All right, here's what happened last night before we get into what's coming up. Last night, NBA, we appreciate those who jumped on board. Unfortunately, we had our NBA playoff winning streak snapped last night uh, with the Pistons. They were up at the half, but they couldn't hold on. Plus 15, they ended up losing by 21. And uh, we're still on a real nice 22 and 9, 71% NBA run. We are still up over $4,000 for $100 per unit betters. Listen, last night, I wasn't real happy to see the Pistons with the lead at the half, short lead, because that gave the Bucks motivation and fuel to come out and play well in the second half. When I take a big double digit dog, I like it when they're down seven or eight, believe it or not, at the break. And then that chalk, the favorite, the team that's supposed to win by a wide margin. Listen, a lot of times they kind of lollygag through the second half, do enough to win by seven or eight, but don't cover the spread. Unfortunately, Detroit came up short, but again, still on a 22-9, and 71% NBA run. I've got one side in NBA action on Thursday. It's available Thursday morning over at DocSports.com. We'll look to extend our NBA run to 23-9. and nine. Listen, as far as baseball and the NHL, we wanted both. Thanks for those who jumped on board in baseball. Uh, we offered up our first seven-unit main event rated play in baseball of the new season, and we cashed with Texas, and uh, that now takes our last eight days run to over $1,700 in the black. Great. Love it. $1,700 ahead uh, for $100 per unit betters over the last eight days. Our current run with sides are now 11-5 and five with their last 16, and going back to last year, 58-38 and 38 with their last 96 baseball plays overall. So don't miss out. Uh, it's kind of an abbreviated card. There's not a full slate on Thursday. We do have one side that rates mismatch status. And the coolest thing about that, you don't have to worry about that spread or that line being too high. The money line on this game is short and uh, we do like it. And we think the value lies with our side and it is a mismatch play. We look to run our record to nine and three in baseball over the last eight days. In hockey, three unit winner last night, uh, with the Dallas Stars as they jumped out early and won big over Nashville. We've got a five-unit play in Thursday's NHL. One play in Thursday's NHL. It'll be available Thursday morning, DocSports.com. All right, free pick in basketball in just a moment. First, the NFL schedules were finally released and revealed by the NFL on Wednesday evening. We've already started jumping into it a bit, and here's what we're going to do. We're going to talk about a one team every single day, starting with Friday's videos, and going right through the next 32 days until we've covered all the teams. One team per day. We won't make you stay here real long on the videos. We'll make it a quick thumbnail sketch, but we'll give you our thoughts on the, what the schedule maker has presented each team, what the over-under wins totals currently are on each team, and uh, we'll give you our thought on each and every team in the NFL. One per day until we're done going into May, so don't miss out on that. It all starts on Friday. All right, let's get to our free pick for tonight. We're going to take the under between Golden State and the Clippers as that series travels to Los Angeles. Listen, a couple of games ago, we told you, or a couple of days ago, I should say, we mentioned taking the over in game two between the Warriors and the Clippers, and we saw the final score reach 266 combined points. We talked about uh, because of the first eight playoff games, all the games going under, that there would be adjustments because the public would get you know, a hold of that, and all of a sudden be playing the unders, and then what do we see the very next day? Two games, two overs, 266 points between uh, the Warriors and the Clippers. And now that line, which was 230, 230.5 in Game 2, is as high as 237 now. We think for Golden State to get back on track after an embarrassing loss the other night, blowing that 31-point lead, uh, you're going to see them get a little tougher on defense. DeMarcus Cousins is out. We get it. Quad injury. Bogut comes in, he can clog the paint a little bit. And uh, so we're looking for the game to stay under the posted total, uh, which is, again, about 236 and a half, 237 as I cut this video. Golden State and the Clippers under. Look for that Golden State defense, which is top 10 in defensive efficiency on the season, uh, to make a statement here. Now, as far as the point spread is concerned, listen, I'm going to tell you what. My NBA play is in one of the two other games on Thursday. I'm not going to mess with Golden State or the Clippers on Thursday, you would think Golden State comes out and whacks some 15, 20-point win, 
At the same time, this has not been a good spread team all season long. And we know that about 90% of the tickets as of right now are all on Golden State. Uh, those kind of numbers don't usually cash. We'll see what happens on Thursday, but we will not have a side in the game. Again, our free pick is on the under between Golden State and the Clippers on Thursday night. All right, listen, if you like these videos, be sure to click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. We do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'll be right back here Friday morning, 4 a.m. Eastern, 1 a.m. Pacific. I'm Scott Sprintz of DocSports.com. Let's put Thursday in the win column.